Here is question number 5 of your school assignment. Let's try to understand how to get the equation from the word problem. Question is, Ashley flew in a light plane in still air to a camp, to a summer camp, 900 kilometers away. On the return flight, a tailwind increased her speed by 45 kilometers per hour. The return trip was 1.5 hours less than the flight to the camp. Determine the speed of the plane on the return, right? That is what we want to find. So we want to find speed on return, right? So let's start with our standard table, which relates distance, speed, and time, right? So that is, that is the table which we always work with. Remember, whenever there is a distance, speed, time question, start with this table. That is the best thing to do. And that will help you to relate the three things, that is distance, speed, and time, for two variations, one going in one direction and the other one returning. So let's say this is distance for us, distance, speed, and time. And here we are going in one direction, on the other side we are returning. And let's fill in the information which we have. It's a good practice to write units. So distance is in kilometers, speed in kilometers per hour, and time in hours. It says 900 kilometers away. That means you're going 900 kilometers both sides. Now, as far as the speed is concerned, on return flight, a tailwind increased her speed by 45 kilometers per hour. So if the speed is x here, it'll be x plus 45. So you need to define this variable let the speed be x, right? And remember, in your answer, you have to actually give answer for x plus 45. Determine the speed of plane on the return, right? So we'll start with this type of information, find x. Remember, in answer, you have to give return speed, not just the value of x, correct? Now, good practices. Once you get to this, you know what time it should take. Time is distance over speed, right? So you can always make your distance speed time triangle here just as in help here. I know that you know it, so at times it is redundant, but I think it's important. So, so time is distance over speed. So remember that time is equals to distance over speed. Okay. So in this case, x should be 900 over x, right? So it's 900 over x. And here it is 900 over x plus 45. Now to get the equation, let's read the question once again. And that statement, the return trip was 1.5 hours less, right, than the flight to the camp. So return trip was, it was faster, it took lesser time. That means difference of these two is 1.5. And that is the equation. So we write 900 over x minus 900 over x plus 45 is equals to 1.5. So that is how you get to the equation. And now it is an easy job for you. Take common denominator of x times x plus 45. Multiply every term with that, right? So when you multiply that, you will get here 900 times x plus 45 minus 900x equals to 1.5x times x plus 45, correct? Now bring all the terms together, you'll get a quadratic equation solved for x. And remember to write down answer with units. And what should be the answer? Return. So answer should be whatever value of x you find from here, write x plus 45 in kilometers per hour as your return speed, right? That is how you should be actually solving word problems, right? So that's the whole idea. Go through this question once again, try to understand, and then do similar questions on your own. Thank you and all the best.